anecdotes from the world of opera. Enjoy funny stories that happened to famous people. Anecdote number 10. How a trumpeter brought a divine back down to earth. Bruno Walter is considered as one of the most important conductors of the 20th century. He has his awakening experience in Hamburg in 1894 at the age of 80. He works for the conductor and later famous composer Gustav Moller as the chorus director of the Hamburg Opera House. Already in early years Bruno Walter often conducts symphonies by Mahler. Moller later confessed. I don't know anyone who understands me as much as you do. Richard Strauss also highly values him as an interpreter of his operas and brings him to Munich. As a Jew, he must emigrate in 1933 from Germany and is celebrated in America as a conductor at the Met, and in the concert hall. He is an obsessed musician. He feels the music deeply. He writes to a friend. I feel deeper than ever before, that the music is the connection with the divine. From his time with Gustav Moller he has internalized the high artistic standards and the will to perfection. During performances and rehearsals he demands the very best from the musicians. But not like Toscanini. Who terrorizes the musicians when they don't do what he wants. No. Walter wants to convince his musicians. So one day he wants to explain to the trumpeter of the Vienna Philharmonic how he wants to have played a solo part on the occasion of an orchestra rehearsal. And it sounds like this. Imagine a forest clearing in summer, the sun penetrates sparsely through the trees, the branches sway lightly in the wind, and now you start coming from a distance. The trumpeter thinks for a moment and replies. Ah, I understand. You mean... Piano. Listen and hear about Bruno Walter and much more in the online opera guide www.operainside.com All about opera